Hey guys, what's up? My name is Brittany, my friends call me Bolts, and welcome back to another video. So today's a very special video because it is December 1st and we are going to be kicking off Vlogmas today. So I've never participated in Vlogmas, this is going to be my first year and I'm really excited. As of right now, I don't have any kind of holiday winter decorations, I don't have any. Last year I didn't even decorate my apartment, I was a bit of a Grinch. So I thought that the perfect way to start vlogmas this year would be to go shopping and just get a bunch of holiday decorations so obviously I'm all ready I got ready for the day and I want to go to at least Target maybe hit up a couple of other stores I just need to get some decorations to get into the holiday mood into the festivities so come along with me also you guys can probably tell that I've been battling a cold so I sound a little bit congested. Well, that's because I'm very congested, honestly. Oh, pray for me. But anyways, let's go. Let's get this started. This is day one of a lot of days. So let's just get into it. Okay, okay. I'm going to take you guys along with me shopping. We'll see how it goes. The Target that's closest to my house is usually really, really busy. So we'll do our best. I'm really stepping out of my comfort zone for this vlogmas, this holiday season. So love you guys. I thought I'd show you guys just a little outfit of the day. Pretty simple, but I have my Doc Martens on. It's kind of rainy, so these are just some mood. Some of my ripped Levi's, and then just a button-up gray top. All right, let's go. Let's get this over with. Okay guys, so I'm in Target and I already found something that I like. Nice and festive. So I'm back home from Target. I only ended up going to Target because I got a lot of stuff there so I didn't really need to go anywhere else. But I was only there for like an hour, hour and a half so that was like the fastest Target run ever. Let's do a little Target holiday haul. Ooh. <laughs> Well, I would say that the Target run was really successful. I didn't want to go too overboard because I want to go overboard when I do my Christmas shopping for my family. So I tried to, you know, be subtle, just get the necessities of what I wanted to get. The first thing I found was this flannel sheet set. Um, honestly, I just needed new sheets. Nothing special. They're just sheets. They're just plaid flannel sheets for the holidays. So, woo! I'm gonna put those on later. So I wanted to get like a wreath or something cute to put on my door for like my neighbors to see and stuff. But the wreaths were kind of expensive. So I ended up just getting this cute like plaid bow. Um, I'm just gonna put that on my little door knocker. I thought that would be kind of cute. So now you didn't go holiday shopping unless you bought a freaking candle. So I got a candle. It's called Mistletoe Kiss. So maybe I can manifest a holiday kiss or something. We'll see. We'll see. But this candle actually smells pretty good. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. So the next thing I got partially includes you. So you can be in it. This doesn't, but I got a stocking that has B on it for Britney Bowl, obviously. Um, I thought the candy cane stripe was really cute. Um, yeah, not a lot to say about that, but I wanted to get a cute little stocking. And of course, I got you a matching one. What do you think? Do you just not give a fuck? These two matching stockings will be adorable to hang together. And I had to get some holiday socks. I chose the Santa ones, the cool Santa ones, because this is just the holiday spirit that I really want to embody this holiday season. Shades on, belly out, no fucks given, Merry Holly Jolly AF. Okay, so let me put these on one moment. This is very important. Oops. <laughs> I 
I need the camera to see it. Do you see now? Do you see it now? What about now? Oh, that's a good angle. Ooh, thumbnail number two. Now I'm unclickable. Can't say anything mean to me. I have my cool sand socks on. I think that this was the hardest purchase decision that I had to make in Target because I wanted a freaking tree. But guess what? I live in a one bedroom studio apartment. So that's not gonna work. I was like, well, maybe I can put some ornaments on like some of the plants I already have, but I don't wanna risk hurting them. So I'm just gonna leave them alone. And I got this white white tree for some reason i was always that person that never wanted to do anything traditional like i didn't want to have like a regular tree regular ornaments regular star anything like that so when i saw this white tree it really just spoke levels to me plus i really want to have a white christmas and i hope i'm going to get that in boise we'll see i don't know so tree which I might decorate. I got some cute little ornaments to go with it. My two favorite colors are pink and blue. So this works out. I actually think it's gonna look kind of cool on the white tree. We'll see, we'll see. And of course, you can't have a Christmas tree without the lights. So I got these lights, just a multicolor set of lights. So I'll put those on there with the cute ornaments and it's gonna be a nice, colorful tree for Christmas. So I had to get a tree topper and I didn't know what to get but I got this and I got it in Spirit of Stella. I just saw it and I immediately thought of her. Hopefully she doesn't try to steal it off the tree but <laughs> I got it. <coughs> oh <coughs> Lord help me. I got this pink. I don't know what it is. It's just cute. It's cute. It's like a pink Sasquatch guy with a scarf, and I really like it. Look, that's. I already know it's gonna be adorable. And with the pink and blue ornaments, it works. It works, right? <laughs> okay. And then I got something that I'll be able to do in one of my other videos if I run out of ideas or something like that. But again, this is just like another must have for, for the holidays. So I got a gingerbread decorating kit and I spent money on the good one. This one has the good candy in it. Hey, Stella's already trying to steal the tree topper. That's not a toy. breaks the gingerbread cookie kit all right we'll do this later i'm sure you guys will join so stay tuned for that i'm sure you guys are really excited and the last thing i got is some almond milk eggnog if you don't drink eggnog then i just can't fuck with you eggnog is really important to the holiday season i've never had dairy free eggnog so I'm really hoping that this tastes good. You know what, let's just pour some up. Let's have a little sip sip. Have a little decoration time. A little hangout. Let's do it. So this is my first time trying the almond milk eggnog. I'll give you guys a little review. Let's see. This is fire. This is really good. 10 out of 10. Good job. I love it. Okay, all right, let's light our candle get all the vibes going if we're gonna be manifesting a holiday kiss we better freaking start now it's December 1st got a lot of time a lot of manifesting to do are you gonna help me Stella this is supposed to be a bonding moment for us mother daughter Stella you're helping good girl good girl <laughs>
Okay, time to put the ornaments on. Blue balls. Now that's a Christmas tree if I've ever seen one. Oh my gosh, it's stunning, beautiful, exquisite. All right, I gotta give you guys a close up look at my tree. All right guys, this is the end of today's video. I hope that this was an acceptable choice of videos for Vlogmas day one. But thank you guys so much for coming along with me. I'm really excited for this month. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat at Brittany Bolt. Stay tuned for what's next. All right, love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow.